Let's see. Hello, hello. How are you? It is the me, Jackie Blue. Um. Um. Just doing some minor adjustments off screen. Uh. Let's see. Up, up. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Mm. 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 Let's see, trying to make my tumbler show up. Mm. I don't get it. Where's my tumbler? My tumbler. Blur page. Here's this one. Here's the. Hold on, let me. Nee. Ah, here we go. Yay! All right. Now, with that being um settled, um. Uh, Mm. Okay. Oh boy. Now to switch mouse devices. Yeah. Yay! All right, let's do get to the doing of this. Oh, my earrings! Ugh. I'm wearing earrings now. Ugh. All right, that's better. All right, all right, let's continue. Last we left off. Um, doll got his tail stuck in the cave. Oh, uh, hold on it. No, 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 whatever. Anyway, they went to collect a glowstone and that doll got his tail stuck from tumbling rocks and now he can't swim properly anymore <laughs> so now it's up to Jackie and Sora to <laughs> collect wood from a sunken ship nearby to help them <sighs> to help the girls block off any um, entrances Something like that. Uh, excuse me. Uh. Mm. Mm. I don't like how the sound sounds. Let me check something real quick. still hear me uh, there I don't hear an echo anymore on my headphones so maybe I did it right hmm hmm anyway all right now let's get to work yay right now I'm fine blah 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 Jackie smiled amu amused uh okay 
Jackie smiled amused at this and said he had been joking. He had been joking earlier about the crack pairing, but it saved him at least. He had actually made a match. This part, he's thinking this part, like, haha. I was joking earlier, but wow, they match each other perfectly. Let's see. Okay. Come on, we'll use these to carry stuff. Then Sora says. We'll be back soon. Stay out of trouble, especially you, Don. Oh, uh, yes. Yeah. And then Don says, "Yes, your highness." It, it, <coughs> it was an informal response. Sora worried too much sometimes, but Don was glad to have someone like her. Hmm. Hmm. <laughs> Someone like her as they left, she took off. She took off her back and took out some bandages before she began to examine Doll's tail. Jackie led the, the way out to the ship made of wood. It was covered in algae <coughs> and there were many tiny fish swimming about. Be careful when you swim close to the shallows, he warned as they swam towards the boat. They can be every bit as dangerous as the deep. Okay, so for this one... Mm. Folder. 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 Folder, folder, and another folder. <laughs> All right. Dude, just checking if I accidentally put a folder in this one. You know? Okay. So now, right here. We'll be back soon. Stay out of trouble. Blah, blah. Yes, your highness. Here it was an informal response. Says <laughs> they left, she took off her packet. Okay. All right, let's see. We're gonna. Oops. Oh, a layer. <laughs> okay. <laughs> let's see. Right here, she says. Um. Oh no, it's white. Oh no, it's thin. Can't have that. Oops. Boop, boop, boop. 40. Yay. 40. Mm 
in there. <laughs> She's kind of responding in a cutesy way. Yay! <clears throat> all, all you did was ruffle your feathers, that's it. Why are you growling? My babyest robot is gr okay. They're not baby r babies anymore, but they grow up so fast. Anyway, all he did was shake himself, and now he's growling. I have pigeons. <sighs> hmm. Let's see. What do I do now? Okay. Mm. Mm, beep, 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 beep. Mm. Right here, I'm drawing a medical pack, I guess. Mm. And right here will be a thought bubble. She began examining dolls. Jackie led the way out to a ship made of wood. It was covered in algae, and there were many tiny fish swimming about. And, and Sora A bunch of fish, I guess. Mm. 
And it's supposed to be the sand, I guess. Okay, that doesn't need to be in a folder, so this is fine. Hmm. 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 Oh wait, I could have added dialogue here. Nuts. Oh. Don't they do that? I'm all over the place. As dangerous as the deepies, deepy weepies. Yay, danger! Yay, just like a comic book. But now you can't see all the fishy fish. That stinks. Making sure these two are connected. Yay! Sora will say, How so? Leviathans hate shallow waters. What could be the danger here? Sora questioned, rather perplexed by the information she was just told. Well, for starters, he began as they swam into a kelp forest. Since we're so much closer to the surface, we're more likely to get hurt by the waves. There is this thing called weather that they react to, causing disasters for us. If you're not deep enough when the big ones hit, you'll end up on the mountains where the landmers are. Okay.
Okay, so let's see. How long will I stream today? Uh, I'll try for an hour, I guess. Mm hmm. How so? Leviathans hate shallow waters. What could be the danger? Uh, where's my mouse? Okay. Hmm. Since Sora is used to living in a much deeper area, it never once occurred to her that the surface could be dangerous. Because where she lives, they don't have a reason to go to the surface. Because, like, it's just all water. This Where Jackie lives and where they all live now, they is like like closer to the beach I guess they got a sunken ship just and the mountains is literally just land land that goes above water that that to them to, to I, I figured for when creating this world I had to come up with words or terms that would make sense to them in a way that would kind of translate over you know how like in Luca they say land monsters like the fish monsters the humans call Luca's people fish monsters and Luca's people call the humans land monsters so you know sea monsters land monsters that kind of like that so yeah So for the mountains that Jackie mentions, those would be the surface land where we humans walk on because it's like there is such, you know, there is such a thing as underwater mountains, which is what the merfolk can have access to, but the ones they can't reach are the ones where we live in, which is literally just the surface. Hmm. Okay, I was taking a sip. Uh, I should draw more background elements. Oops. Let's see. Hmm. There, sand. Yay, makes it more visually appealing, I guess. Alright. And save my work. Let's see, we're for starters. Uh. He began as they swam into a cow forest.
Oh no, I'm not leaving enough room for bubbles. Okay. Uh. Mm. Uh, well, for starters. Mm. Yay. Alright, now to adjust. Uh. <laughs> well, for starters, Since we're so much closer to the vivid, okay. I keep forgetting to draw his hair long for this story because. It would, because he's an adult in this story, and, and so his hair would be very long, I guess. To think out whether they distract us, if we, uh, they test us. Mm. Ah, okay. I know how to do this. Mm.
Yay, lots of folders. <laughs> okay. Da -da 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 -da. Hmm, half an hour. I'm going good. Yay. Landomers. <laughs> right, she wouldn't know what humans are because like her whole kingdom is completely isolated from the outside world. Even if a ship were to pass over their kingdom, they, the ocean currents would probably carry the ships away or something. I don't know. 
I never thought about that part of the lore. Just that they're isolated by very strong currents. Yeah, sometimes you'll see them around here. They live on the highest mountains, like this one. Mountains that are so tall that they go beyond the water's surface. Landmers look a lot like us, except that they don't have a tail like we do. Instead, they have an extra set of arms there. Mm. Hmm. Okay. Hmm. Oops. <laughs> hmm. <laughs> Cookie time! Yay! Cookie! I have a D&D &D character who likes cookies. He didn't start off liking cookies. It, it's just that like at the beginning of the campaign, they get introduced to the character who provides the in inciting the, the introductory character, I guess. You know, the one who puts them all on the quest. And, like, the guy is like, Here, I make cookies! But, you know, he's a fairy, so, you know. So, like, the other person's character does not accept... He doesn't... 
He knows it's bad to accept cookies, but it's also bad to reject them. So he takes the cookies, he takes some cookies, but doesn't eat any, and my character, they, they fail the roll, like an intelligence check, and <laughs> you started eating the cookies, and since they're made by fairies, and this fairy guy, he has nothing better to do, they, he makes really awesome cookies, so... In my imagination, it's gotten to a point where my character is kind of addicted to cookies. Oh. Mm. I'm trying to make the perspective look interesting. Oh well. Uh, excuse me. Landmers look a lot like us, except that they don't have a tail like we do. Instead, they have an extra set of arms. Okay. Disgusted. I don't want to do that. Mm. Gosh, how do I want to draw his expression? just not to draw his face just go straight with the diagram <laughs> Mm. 
Hmm. I wanna draw this creepier. Okay, so you got Hmm, this is basically how I guess Sora would imagine it as Jackie is describing it. good <laughs> okay Because remember, Sora has no idea what humans look like, so do it. So all she has is Jackie to describe them. Because he says they have an extra set of arms instead of a tail, so yeah. Anyway, yay, I did it. Save. Okay. She simply laughs at him. That sounds so fake. Oh. They are very much real. Be careful when you see them. They have things that can help them breathe underwater. Both. Oh, let them seem to be only interested in collecting shiny things from sunken ships. But some of them have spears. He carefully plucked a sea urchin from a kelp. Like the ship we're about to go to, he munched through the spines. Also, some of the fish you might encounter can be dangerous, especially octopi. Hmm. turn white Ugh. anyway my ink turned white anyway uh. mm. Mm. 
Yay. Okay. I think right here would be a good place to stop. <sighs> I did really good. So, yeah. Thank you for stopping by to watch. And hopefully, I can continue to stream more and I'll see you all next time. Bye!